This is the OptoJump Next by Microgate. It's an all-in-one sprint, run and jump testing tool that has the potential to boost your sprint performance on many different levels, if you know how to use it. And that's exactly what we're going to discuss in this video. How can it be used and which are the positives and negatives of this system? But first, the OptoJump can be bought as a separate 1 meter strip or a full 5 meter or longer, possibly even up to 100 meter setup. The price of a 1 meter setup comes in at around 3000 euros or around 3300 US dollars at the time of recording. For a 5 meter setup, this will be 13000 US dollars or 12000 euros. Like I said, the OptoJump is a testing tool, and the parameters it can measure can be divided into two categories, one being prehab slash rehab tests, and two being the performance tests, with the performance tests of course being the most important one for coaches like us. Before we can go over all the performance tests you can do, it's important to know how the measurements get taken, so you can take into account where the blind spots of this tool are. The OptoJump is an optoelectrical system, which means that the bars communicate with each other via a laser signal that gets sent from one side to the other. The duration and place of every interruption gets detected and from there a lot of calculations can be made to determine a lot of interesting parameters. On the rehab testing side, for example, you could place both bars on a treadmill, the camera aimed to the front of the athlete, and measure the differences in contact time between the injured and a healthy leg or in a prehab situation to discover possible imbalances that increase the risk of injury. In both scenarios, the video feedback can have an added benefit as it can help to deduce where or what causes the imbalance that is being measured. While these rehab and prehab tests are a nice bonus, the main focus for us on this channel is of course on the performance side. This too is where the OptoJump really shines in our opinion. The most obvious application is for jump testing. Everything from testing the athlete's explosiveness through for example squat jumps, to stiffness tests like the 10-5 jump test or drop jump test to determine an athlete's reactiveness on the ground are all a piece of cake for the OptoJump. If you want, you can even place the OptoJump in the squat rack and do a full jump testing protocol with increasing weights so you can create a force velocity profile. Everything jump testing wise, ground contact times, flight times, jump height, reactive strength index can all be measured. The accuracy and reliability of the OptoJump has even been scientifically researched and validated to almost perfectly the same as the gold standard of jump tests, that being force platforms. Besides the jump testing, however, there is something really impressive that you can do with the opto jump, but it does require the 5 meter setup or even longer. Depending on the length of the setup, you can use the opto jump to create acceleration profiles, max velocity profiles, or even full sprint profiles that'll help you to detect athletes' weaknesses, but also their strengths and what makes them unique. These type of speed, acceleration or sprint tests are being regularly done by professional sprinters like Marcel Jacobs and others to track if their training is successful. And speaking of success, that brings us to the pro and the cons of the OptoJump next. The biggest con, if you remember the beginning of this video, is the price, especially if you want to be able to create speed profiles. This setup is expensive and is almost solely an option for big institutions or sports federations. Second small con is the time it takes to set up. With the bars, cables and camera, this setup takes 5 or more minutes depending on the length of the setup you need. It's a bit too time consuming if you just set this up for one or two athletes, so make sure you always have a big group to test. The final con concerns the software. It's not compatible with Macs, so make sure you have a PC or laptop running Windows. The software itself is pretty straightforward, but nothing special, it does what it has to do. Besides these cons, there are only positives to using the OptoJump. Like we already covered, there's a multitude of tests that you can do, performance, rehab and prehab wise, which are accurate and reliable. The software is free to use, so no hassle with an expensive subscription after buying expensive hardware. Besides that, the software makes it very easy to fly through a full squad of athletes thanks to the multi-selection tool that just cycles to the next athlete in the lineup after every test. If there is a test that's not built into the software, you can even create your own ones. 
Now, if even after this video you need more info or if you bought OptoJump and want to know how to set up the whole system, make sure to check out our setup guide by clicking the video on the top right corner and below that you can find a video where we compare the OptoJump to the super cheap $15 MyJump app for if you're interested.